to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football there is a barely a cloud evident the world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts barely a breath of wind so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best the teams i know are pumped for this they are fantastic scenes in the stands there is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. The Olimpico, obviously an integral part of Roma's proud history, their home since 1953. A mouth-watering game this between two very high-quality sides, a treat for everybody here. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. As you can see, we've already started here. So, Jim, tell me this. Who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Ederson. He's got great technique, Peter, and for a goalkeeper, he's got the passing range of a top-class midfielder. I think his, his team will be looking to use him as a, a foundation from which to build both sustained spells of possession as well as quick counter-attacks. He's got a phenomenal left foot. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Clive Hurts. Will be a throw in. Bernardo Silva. Jao Cancelo. Bernardo Silva. And it's Cancelo. Jao Cancelo not easily shrugged off the ball. Gundawan. It is early, but the game hasn't yet sparked into life. Rodri kings it out wide. Mukatari. Cristante. Kolarov. Smalling drives it forward. Neither team has yet managed to impose any authority, and uh, as a consequence, this game's just drifted. Unda delivers the ball. It's out of play for a goal kick. And it's played forward. Fernandinho. Zinchenko. Sterling. Nothing but a skill there. Bernardo Silva. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Jao Cancelo. And it's Kundawa. And here's Agu Aguero! He's got away with one there. Defending of the desperate variety. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Receives it in a good position. Bernardo Silva gets it out to the wing. A chance to play it in. Gundogan. Bernardo Silva. Rodri. And here's a... It's a Guero! 
Same again, same outcome. They're just lacking the cutting edge, Peter. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. Kolarov with the crossfield ball. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Under. It's Bruno Perez. Checo! Oh, that is rather wayward. Kolarov pumps it into the area. It's Sterling. Balls out on the left now. Sterling gets it into the middle. And he just whacks it away. Sterling really just wasn't quick enough then. Well, his thinking certainly wasn't. Didn't make use of what I felt were some very good options. Kolarov. Kleivert goes to the cross. Final action of the first half. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Any strong opinions on the first half? Roma have been playing relatively well from what I've witnessed. Good movement and the ball retention has been quite strong, and it's led to a few chances. It's just that cutting edge that's lacking at the moment, and it's fixable. Roma head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. It's like a cagey game. Are the team any further forward than they were when they started out? And we're already back on the way here. So deadlock still as the second half begins. Clivert. Federico Fazio. Clivert. They've seen lots of the ball, trying to go for it a bit, a bit of creativity and adventure. Gundogan. Otamendi. Sterling. Zinchenko. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Manchester can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Pastore. Lukatari. Kolarov. Cristante. Lukatarian. Bernardo Silva positions himself well and cuts it out. Gundogan. Nil-nil still. It's a game that needs a bit of life injected. It's gone for a throw-in. Lovely bit of skill. Promising cross. Tries to get it clear. Checo. Clivert. Clivert goes on a charge down the left. Bernardo Silva. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection on what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Hoists it forward. And it's Perotti. Hit into the middle. Ball's loose, and he's after it. 
And he heaves it forward. Mukatari. He's in! It's Jekyll! He's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. That's the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. He's gone for the shots. Oh, how's that for a goal? Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy. All goals are welcome, but when they come at a time like that, they're priceless. Dispatched expertly, nicely done. A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, I had a feeling this was coming. Still, there's a fair bit of time if you're going to think about defending it now. Cristante gets it back. Rodri battles to win it back. Kolarov. Perotti, hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Jao Cancelo goes looking, Silva, Jao Cancelo. Rodri, De Bruyne, and here's Sterling, played into the middle. Stitch defending, but that'll do. Rodri. Roma leading here by this still precarious 1-0 margin. And that has been clubbed away. He's going to have a play. Zinchenko. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Perotti. Big chance! Really well taken goal. And with that goal comes comfort. Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Well, some fans are already on their way out. So that to me says everything, Peter. Zinchenko. Silva. And here's Aguero. Aguero! Oh, just wide. Oh, and it's such a good effort. And maybe the target really should have been hit. Fernandinho. And it's De Bruyne. De Bruyne. João Cancelo. Shapes to shoot! And that 
is the last effort of the game. Solid, if not especially fancy, always in control. They did enough to win it. Your reflections then, Jim. Roma were victorious here, and rightly so. When you're allowed free license to strut your stuff in wide positions, you can only see one winner. And I just really liked what I saw here.